Welcome into the ADN studio where we are continuing our summer football preview series as we get closer to kickoff. I'm Haley Outen. It's back to the West Division today to take a close look at Houston. The Cougs will look to the new leadership of head coach Dana Holgerson with the hopes of getting back to the American title game. The good news for Holgerson is he inherits one of the most dangerous quarterbacks in the country in Derek King. King is back from a season-ending knee injury and will look to top a Lights Out 2018 campaign. King threw for 36 and ran for 14 touchdowns, and the senior gets it done through the air and is extremely mobile on the ground. In fact, King had a rushing touchdown in every game he appeared in last season. Senior Patrick Carr will also be expected to carry a lot of the workload on the ground. Carr led the team last season with almost 900 yards and five touchdowns. Through the air, the receiving court is absolutely loaded. King will look to his go-to guy, Marquez Stevenson, who led the team with over 1,000 yards and 75 catches last year. Senior Keith Corbin was equally effective, averaging 17 yards per catch with 10 touchdowns. Defense could be a different story for Houston this year. They replaced the top 10 NFL draft pick in defensive tackle Ed Oliver. However, overall, this group will need to improve across the board. The defense allowed 45 or more points in four of the last five games of the 2018 season. If the defense can take a step in the right direction, Houston's offense should be able to put up the numbers to get this team back to the American Championship game come December. Last year, the Cougs led the American and were ninth in the nation in passing efficiency. They finished seventh in the nation in yards and averaged 44 points per game. We'll find out if Houston is up to the challenge right out of the gates as they head to Oklahoma for a Sunday night showdown on September 1st. What are you expecting to see from Holgerson and the Cougars in year one? Keep the conversation going using the hashtag AmericanFB.